Okay, so you're going to have your fire stand right against the wall. Her bottom heel is going to be touching. Make sure both legs are straight. You can hit a high V, and then we're going to pick one leg up, and we're going to bring it all the way. You're going to kind of grab the calf area, and then we're going to push until the athlete says stop. Okay, and you're going to hold for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you're going to have your athlete grab with both hands. You're going to grab their shoe, and then you're going to hold for five, four, three, two, one. And then they're going to push your hands down using their leg for five, four, three, two, one. Give it one last stretch up as far as you can. And then slowly bring it back down. And then we'll do the same thing with the other leg. Watch that when we're doing this, that we're not throwing our hips out. We want to keep our hips nice and square. Okay, so same thing. High V, and we're pushing up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then they're going to grab and hold for one, two, three, four, five. Now they're going to push against you for one, two, three, four, five. And then all the way up as far as they can. And then guide it slowly down to the ground. Now we're going to have our fire turn around. They're going to have their chests to the wall, and we're going to bring our arms up above our head. And now we're going to grab one leg. You're going to have one hand on the lower back hip area, keeping those hips square. And then we're going to lift through that leg, grabbing the front part of their shin, and holding for about 10 seconds. And then they're going to push down for five, four, three, two, one, and then give it just a little bit of a stretch and back down. And then same thing on the other side. Here, and lifting for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Resist for one, two, three, four, five, and give it a little stretch. And then back down. 